Hi, I'm Mark Messersmith. I'm the COO of Halcyon, and today we're going to talk about the zero gravity side mount system, the next generation in side mount. We're excited to be listening and working with our divers from all over the world to bring new ideas to you. And uh, today we're, we're looking at the side mount, uh, named after zero gravity from our friends in Mexico who've been working with us to build a system that is ideal for temperate waters, and uh, but still fun for explorers and for recreational side mount level divers. Uh, we just surfaced here after a 90 minute swim and scootering through a most beautiful cave here in Mexico and uh, we're trying to uh, continue on with the dive and the exploration on this side of the sun. Um, so this is a, a, a great opportunity for us uh, halfway through to uh, speak five minutes about uh, the new Alcyon uh, side mount uh, harness. This unit is ideal for temperate waters. We've been using it quite successfully here in Florida, but also in Mexico. And it's capable of, of taking the aluminum 80s, the 11s that most people are very comfortable with. They, you can also take the steel 85s or the, or the 12s, uh, and it works very, very well. You'll notice it has a number of features, and what we focused on was keeping it very, very streamlined. So while side mount is used for all kinds of purposes around the world, we, would, we truly wanted a product that is still reflective of our high quality innovation and exploration. So this system can be used for doing serious explorations. It's very streamlined. If you notice, there's nothing protruding out here. And so as a diver was to go through a very narrow passageway and particularly encounter an overhead, there is a lot of room that, uh, that uh, can accommodate uh, contact or even damage. And if you look, the actual the inflation area, the bladder, is a little farther uh, down and it's on the sides. So we have a very streamlined system that uh, allows for a very sleek movement through the overhead with the bladders and the inflation on the side. This is quite unique to the zero gravity uh, because when it's either deflated or inflated, all the, all the counter ballast, all the buoyancy is tucked in right behind the tanks. I mean, we are diving and exploring here uh, in Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula for about 22 years. So uh, we are diving different uh, equipment configuration that includes uh, back mount equipment, uh, standard back mount equipment, uh, back mounted rebreather, side mounted rebreather, and of course, uh, side mount diving. So I believe that uh, any exploration, uh, specific exploration, will require the right tool for us to use. And I think that as a smaller bladder from Alcyon, um, side mount harness enable us to just continue on with the explorations that we have been doing here in almost over two decades now. While we're also looking in the back, you see the handles, we call them the door handles, uh, are, are tucked in and, and they have multiple options. You can, you can have them at this side. If you're a narrower profile, you can move them in. A little taller, you can move them down. So there are some, some options there. Uh, we have the dump valve. It's, it's low, which if you're moving through overheads, forward or backwards, it still sits very low and it's actually uh, below the height of the, the handles. And we have it off to the side. And, and most of our divers are used to using a left-hand dump. So this is very natural for them. And so instead of reaching here, they just move a few more inches or a few more centimeters over. And it's a very natural reach and quite available regardless of their configuration. We have the, uh, the, uh, the harnesses and it could be configured in a number of ways. Presently, right now, it goes like a regular uh, traditional harness and it, and it slides in the back. We have some configurations where we've had people put it up front but it, it gives you the option of, of coming back. It's fully adjustable, so we can make it for taller or shorter folks. And in fact, we have the ability to put the inflation on the left or right side. If you look just past uh, Ori's side, I'm gonna have you spin just a touch. We have another uh, port there that if somebody was so inclined, they can move this inflation hose from their left side to the right side and, and flip it the other way. The rest of the system is quite traditional and the same. We have a crotch strap, D-rings, uh, we've put D-rings on both sides for adding additional stage bottles. 
So this is roughly the, the system. We were looking for something that's more streamlined, less ballast than what we've built before, and provides our explorers a tool that allow them to spend a lot of time in the water, but at the same time, it's a, it's a great introductory system. Comes right out of the box as you see it, and you're ready to be in the water in minutes.